so lang wie dir, mate. Uh, I'm Rob Greenhouch, um, day two of the Moth Nationals, another epic day out there on Botany Bay. Uh, cracking conditions, nor'easter today, and um, four races, it was pretty hard work. I keep coming back to moth sailing because it's so unique and it's, you know, it's, there's nothing else like it. The speeds the boats are doing now is incredible and um, the, the talent in the fleet is amazing now. It's just difficult sailing and um, it's a sort of a sailing it's as hard as you want to make it and uh, it just makes it it's just yeah it's incredible just seeing how everyone's getting better and better there's so many young guys coming back in now and they are amazingly good and uh, you, yeah you've got to be on your game I think sailing is over the last 10 years 15 years it's been evolving and evolving and now we're um, you know we're seeing it in moth class again there's been another big push forward and it will keep going, it will keep coming. So I, I wouldn't say it's made a huge jump in the last year, it's just continuous. And as people get in who are keen and you know are frothing on it and want to work harder, the boats go faster. And when people try hard, the boats go quicker and, and that's all there is to it. And I think now we've got a, uh, you know, a good spread of boat builders and foil designers, um, a good spread of sail makers. And obviously everyone wants to be better than someone else, so um, there's just good development. Yeah, we're, we've been super lucky this week with the weather. Obviously day one, there was, there was no wind, but we've had two, two uh, great foiling days so far, a southerly and then a nor'easter. I think we'll get a nor'easter on Australia Day, and it, fingers crossed it's gonna be a cracker. And then potential uh, southerly for the last day of the regatta. So I, I can see another eight races coming, um, and uh, we should get a full series.